What is up, everybody? I'm Dear Asshole. It's finally Friday. And Lonnie from Midland writes, Dear Asshole, the sex life in my relationship has gotten a little stale, so I'm looking for new positions. Any suggestion? Well, Lonnie, my personal favorite is Dear Asshole on top of your girl banging her like she's my little toe on the corner of every damn piece of furniture in my living room. Whoa, wait a minute. I see you're kind enough to also send a picture of your lovely wife, and I'm good. She is to boners as Sid's is to infants. I bet her name is Sid, isn't it? If you're looking for a position to make your sex life better with that, I'd go for the old Ray Charles. That's where you gouge your own eyes out and beat her with your walking stick. My question is, how the hell did you get the Crypt Keeper out of his coffin long enough to fuck him? Hello, boys and ghouls. <laughs> Bill Cosby took one look at her and roofied himself. I'd rather bang the horse on the pack of Trojans than use a Trojan on her. Sir, if you've managed to keep it up for that time and time again, year after year, then holy shit, I can only imagine what you'd do to a hottie. The poor girl would collect disability for the rest of her life after she was done with you. After I said that, every filthy slut this side of Dallas is gonna be sniffing you out. Not because they're looking for a good lay, but because we all know a lazy horse will be with any guy if it means they don't ever have to work again. At least three of them had to go change their panties after I said that because nothing makes a girl more wet than the thought of doing absolutely nothing for the rest of their worthless existence. Ladies, let it be known, Dear Asshole is all for equal roles in relationships. But most of you seem to have a really fucked up view of equal. Just because you have a part-time job folding clothes at the mall and you take two hours of college a semester doesn't get you out of helping a guy who's working his ass off 14 hours a day, six days a week. Get off your ass and pull your weight. Me personally, I cook like a four-star chef. You know why? Because every single girl I've ever been with doesn't. Bitch, spaghetti isn't cooking. And and fellas, if she's the one working, you better pull out a damn feather duster and a vacuum and get your ass to cleaning. That is all the time I have for today. Get your questions in at kbat.com under the What's Hot toolbar. Jess, you have won the $20 gift certificate this week to Triple Threat Sports Bar in Midland. And remember, opinions are like assholes. Everybody has one, and KBAT is no exception. If I've pissed you off today, <laughs> grab the brown paper bag and saddle up, cowboy. Feel free to go fuck yourself.